Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is Robina again. Uh, I just want to start off by saying that I uh, love, 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 love Redken products. Redken doesn't know I exist. I don't get any money from Redken. It's the only thing I really know about, you know, more than other products. So I'm trying to share my knowledge with you just so you would um, be able to either help your clients or uh, maybe help yourself. So the first thing, I mean, the thing that I want to talk about today is picking the right product. I know this sounds absolutely crazy, but I can't begin to tell you how many times I've, you know, been in the salon doing someone's hair and they're like, oh, I can't take my hair. It's just so curly and so frizzy and I don't know what's going on and I use this and I use that and I'm like, well, what are you using to style with? And they're like, oh, I'm using a mousse. I'm using this great volumizing shampoo and I'm like, okay, so let's start from there because if you have really curly hair, Mousse and volumizing, volumizing shampoo is going to make your hair puff out. You're going to be huge. So really, the thing is, really think about what your hair is doing. Is it curly? Is it straight? Does it go flat? Does it poof out? Um, you know, what are the issues that it has? Is it when the humidity comes, does it get crazy? Whatever it may be. And then look at your hair products and pick the right one. Now, uh, here in Pennsylvania, it's absolutely freezing, freezing, freezing. Um, there's heat on. A lot of people use fireplaces. So all the moisture is getting taken out of the air. So for now, what I'm using is my All Soft, which is amazing. Um, All Soft has a shampoo and a conditioner, and then I also spray this on my hair. It gives it so much moisture. It makes your hair feel like a million bucks. The fragrance is unbelievable. This is not necessarily for styling. This is for me to keep my hair nice and moist. Um, okay, if you have, say, very fine hair and you have one of those cute little short haircuts and you want some height, you get no height back here, not only can the haircut help you, because it, of course it should, um, but you can also use a product to help your haircut work better. So here's what I'm going to mention. It's Quick Tease. If you'll notice on Redkin, they all have a number. The numbers tell how strong it is. But don't be deceived because um, Redkin's products are amazing like this one. This is a new one called Control Addict. It's, this is a, whoa, let's get you back there. This is a hairspray. This is a hairspray as well. Um, Control Addict just came out. It's a number 28. It's the highest number. But you're thinking, oh, Robina, I can't even comb through my hair if I use 28. No. This one is amazing because it actually is one that you can brush through. It holds phenomenally and it has shine factor in it, which is like diamond oil, which I will tell you about in one second. So here's a 28, and it is the best holding one of their line for their hairspray. It's amazing. It smells great. Um, but you can brush it. That's like a plus. Um, so anyway, back to quick tease. So you have short hair. You want to give it a little lift. This is like teasing your hair in a bottle. No matter where you put it, it stays. I mean, I am not kidding. I'm, I don't know if I'm doing this right because I'm probably spraying the wrong side because it's back backwards. But, I mean, if you have a really short haircut... Whoa, this side, and you're using quick tease. I mean, it it literally will just grow and grow and grow. My hair looks crazy right now because I don't, um, I'm not doing it right. But this stuff is like somebody teased your hair and they put it in and it's full, 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 full. Um, okay, the hairspray. All right, so if you have curly hair and you want it to be straight, don't put a mousse on it, don't put a curl enhancer on it. Use something like a line. This is a straightener. This is a 12. It's awesome. Uh, I used to have people in my chair that had this beautiful, like my texture hair, which is like a fine texture, with curls in their hair. I'd put some line in. I mean, you could use it on anybody, and it would just make it gorgeous, straight, after my blow dry, beautiful. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay. So you do have curly, and you love it, and you want it to be more curly. So what are you going to do? You're going to put some 07 
fashion waves. Oh my gosh, talk about beach in a bottle. You're laying out, it's a gorgeous day, your hair looks fabulous because you use the salt spray, just like the ocean. This stuff is amazing. I love, love, love this for curly hair. All right, and let me tell you, oh, fine hair. You can't get any lift. These two are phenomenal together. This is Guts, which is a 10. It totally sprays like a single shot, like boom, like right out. I can't see if you could see this, but it doesn't a spray like in a big poof. And you literally lift up the hair exactly where you want to spray it at the root. You can guide where you want it, and it's a mousse, and it's amazing. Oh, look, my hair's getting even bigger from the fabulous quick teeth. And this will actually make your hair so, so fluffy and so, uh, like, um, you know, a lot of volume, which is perfect. Okay? I'm just giving you, like, examples. I mean, they have so many products. It's amazing. Um, another thing, like, for instance, it is, okay, I wash my hair every other day. I just like to. The second day, it actually looks better than the first day. So what do I use? I use Pillow Proof. Pillow Proof is amazing. Now, I just want to give you a heads up. Anything in the pink bottle is for protection from heat. Yes, like 420 degrees. So the first day, I go to sleep with my hair wet. I put maybe like a little bit of mousse on it because I wanted to get it full. It gets like texture at nighttime, so it'll get really uh, like a little messy, tousled look, and then I will just put a little bit of either of these waves to enhance it, or maybe I'll curl it with the curling iron, make it look a little more curly, but then the second day, I think maybe I want to wear it straight, or just want to wear it like with a little wave in it. I'll run for this. This stuff takes all the oils out of your hair, it cleans your hair, if you're laid up in bed and you need a shampoo, you put this in your hair, it's amazing. All you do is take it. You spray it where your hair gets oily, anywhere, you brush it, and then you style as usual, and your hair is so clean. Another thing I use this for is, like, say when you have, like, a little girl, I just want to give, like, an example, and they have, like, that soft baby baby hair, they have no texture whatsoever, you can put this in their hair, spray it all over, and then it'll give it texture, so when you go to put it in a ponytail, or you go to put it in a curling iron, it just doesn't slip right out like crazy. That stuff is awesome. Oh, and if you're in the salon, Pillow Proof is your best, best friend. Why? Not only does it protect your hair from the heat, which is the blow dryer, the curling irons, the flat irons. You should be telling your clients about this. It will blow dry the hair like, like I don't know, like 80% faster. Or I forgot what they say, like 73. A crazy amount, like... This really does work. Your hair dries faster and it protects your hair. I love it. You shake it, you use it. It's phenomenal. Um, another one that I love is, uh, of course, this is a Zero Two Satin Wear. This is an oldie but a goodie. This has been around forever. Another protector, but it's a Zero Two, so if you like your hair to be really, really natural, this is your best friend. It's awesome. It's a cream. You put it on. You blow dry. You look fabulous. So I just wanted to give you like a little, um, a little kind of idea of what you should be using for what thing. Think about your situation. Think about where you live. Also, when your hairdresser suggests this to you, yes, we do get a little commission from this, but it's not a ton of money. It's actually just maybe a little bit of the percentage. It's not anything to write home about. I think the hairdresser really honestly, at least I know I was, more concerned with you maintaining the beautiful hairstyle that I used to give my clients when they left. Because when you leave, when you leave the salon, that's your hairdresser's signature. I had someone tell me that one time, and I always remember that, that that's my signature. So I really wanted people to look so fabulous when I got home. I would show them how to blow dry, I'd give them the products. And then they would be so happy, and you would be happy, and then people could stop them and say, hey, your hair looks so great. Where'd you get it done? And you're like, oh, Robina did it for me. And then you can get more clients, and it just makes everybody happy. So, you know, tell your clients what they need to use. Show them how to use it, and use them on them when you're in the salon. And then when they leave, you'll be like, oh, yeah, these are the, couple these are the ones I use today. 
would you like to try one? Do you think maybe you'd like to try this? And if they say yes, then that's great because then that way they can look great when they get home. So um, that's my little tip to use the right product for what you need. Use the right shampoo and conditioner. And also think about the weather because that affects it as well. You know, if it's fall, spring, summer. And um, I'd say that's about it. Um, I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, I'm not a Red King expert. I, you know, I'd call the hotline if I were you or I would just you know, find out for you. So if you have any questions, you can leave them for me. I really appreciate you watching my channel. I hope this was helpful and have a great, great day. Oh, okay. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.